get to the first geocache, we have to take the city bus. Uh, Dos Cerveza sure. and the geocache. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Mucho gracias. Remember, sometimes the geocache might be inside an establishment, especially a touristy place like this. From a visit with the boys from Abbey Road, we moved on to a bike ride down the boardwalk. Mazatlan's Malacan is 13 miles long and is a great place for a walk, jog or a bike ride. It beautifully hugs the coastline and offers amazing views of the Pacific Ocean. We were hoping to bike to several locations of our last adventure lab, but did we mention how long the boardwalk was? Some days you just got to get really creative in how you get your adventure labs. We opened up the stages on the bus and now we just gotta find the answers. Mm -hmm. Got one more to go and we hope to get that one on the way back to the hotel. Now we're in the little taxi cab on the way to the lighthouse. This is the way to travel. Our driver's the best. You can see everything out the windows. What windows? No windows. <laughs> no doors. <laughs> this is a traditional taxi in Mazatlan. Yep. The name is Pulmonia. Pulmonia. Pulmonia is an open taxi. Okay. Mazatlan is a is a only have pulmonia in the world. Oh, very nice. Only Mazatlan. It's a nice taxi. No windows, no doors. No doors. Yeah. <laughs> it's a way to go. Thank you. Coming up, we're going to pass several locations of an adventure lab we had done the day before. The view is beautiful. Oh, the view. Yeah. Appreciation, every Mazatlan. We're at the base of the hill now, and it's a big climb up. We're on our way. Something like 740 meters in elevation rise. We're going to the tallest lighthouse in the world. Mm -hmm. Seven hundred and forty-five meters up the uh, flat part. Now the stairs begin. Three hundred and sixty-six stairs for a total elevation gain of one hundred and forty-five meters. Is the the worst already done, or is the worst yet to come? <laughs> At least. Uh, at least there's some shady places to rest along the way. I hate to do this all in one go in the sunshine. That'd be brutal. <laughs> you see new stuff every time you stop and look. That yeah, yeah, trying to gain a little more light. Mm. Get all the way to the top and the view it's is spectacular it's so pretty and clear and white yes there's fog everywhere <laughs> everywhere we were a little afraid as we were climbing up you could see the sea fog off in the distance covering the horizon and closing in and by the time we got to the top it was all covered and there was nothing to see but the sea fog is rolling past the top of the mountain here and we can see the three islands from across uh, that are across from our hotel 
and we can see uh, down the coast where we rode our bikes on this previous episode and where our hotel is far off in the distance. And you can just kind of see it peeking out now. Now that we're up here, <laughs> the virtual all well, requires you to get a photo of yourself with the lighthouse. So here we are. Cheese. Can I see the lighthouse? There oh, it I is. can't do it. Like there that. it is. Okay, get your head over this way. You're in the way. Oh, you okay? You can do it that way. We hope you enjoyed your hike and will come back soon. Well, I think once was enough for me. <laughs> yeah, it was well worth it. We hope you enjoyed coming with us, but I think now it's time for a little break, a snack and a drink before we do anything else. We're back on the uh, pneumonia. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to get the last the adventure, the Palomino. Palomino, okay, Palomino, whatever. And we're going to get the very last adventure lab location we need here in Mazatlan. And then we'll be complete. No, wait a minute, there's one one more ship cache we're going to get. Yes. And I think that's for a one minute one. So, hang on, we're going to get there. Wrap it up here with, with our. So that'll be the end of our adventure no, lab. Not yet. We have to wait till we get there. Well, there we go. Through ingenuity, we got all of the adventure labs. And a little bit of driving around. Yeah, <laughs> it was fun. Keep watching, there's more caches to be found. Where will geocaching take you?